First, our goal would be, obviously, to have a solid record, to compete well, to have our wins be examples of the hard work that we've been putting in. Obviously, going right in that same line, it would be to make it to playoffs and to have a uh, promising performance in postseason play. But it has to be said that my other goal for this team is to be united. Uh, united off the field and on the field. This preseason, you know, we've had a lot of standouts with a ton of girls joining the team that are brand new and a lot of our returners stepping it up. But I would say most especially has been Elizabeth Krillich. Uh, she was a standout last season as a junior. This year she's stepping in as a captain as one of our seniors. I have very high expectations for her and I think she's really going to shine in our conference play. This year, specifically what we're doing is for our 6 a.m. practices on Wednesday, we are coming early to say a Divine Mercy Chaplet at 5.45, which is a big sacrifice for a lot of us. We like our sleep, but it's an amazing sacrifice to make for this team. It just shows, the, just shows how much we care and how much we love each other, and it is a sisterhood. It is a bond that will be carried on for years to come. So this past year, uh, we graduated four starting players, three of them were our starting defensive line. So I, I think a big obstacle is going to be rebuilding that defensive line. Now we've got a lot of good up and comers, a lot of returners that are ready to step up and fill that role. So once we've got that chemistry, I think that's going to be very smooth. And then I'd say just building on that, rebuilding the team. Every, every season as you get new players, as you lose some of your old, uh, it's a matter of building that chemistry, making sure that when you step on that field, everything's fluid, everything's beautiful, and that what you do uh, glorifies the Lord and the beautiful game of soccer.